Hello and welcome to a basic leveling and experience tutorial. This is the art we're going to be using. First thing we're going to do is add a basic 2D node, change it to name world, add a control node to it, and add a few UI elements. Two texture buttons, a sprite and a child sprite, as well as two labels. We're going to rename them to our appropriate name, and now we're going to add the textures for normal and hover for the buttons. We're going to just move it with Alt and do the same for Blue. From here we're going to add the Experience, uncenter it, and we're going to add the Child Experience, uncenter it, make it so that in Visibility it shows behind the parent, and we're also going to make it so that the X scale is 0. We're going to move it to where we want, and we're going to rename the labels, change the text, and move them to where we want. We're going to now save our scene, and we're going to move on to creating a global node. To create a global node, we're going to add a new scene, go to other node, just add a node and add a script to that node. Get rid of the junk and add free variables, an int for level, a float for experience, and an array for experience bracket, as well as our function. We take one argument in our add experience function, which is the experience points. We check if the level is not within the final bracket. If it is not, we will run a for loop for every experience point. For every loop, we add an experience point and we check the following. If the current experience value is greater or equal to the experience bracket level, we will run the following. We reset the experience to zero by minusing the current experience bracket and we increase the level. We also check if we have reached max level and if so, we reset the experience to 0.0. .0. Now we're just going to be saving our node, going into project settings to make it a global node, go into auto load, select the scene, open, and add it to the path. Next we're going to be adding our UI code, so we're going to go back to the control and adding a script to it, getting rid of the junk, and adding the signals from the texture buttons into the script. In the control script, we're going to be adding references to the sprites we want to change, as well as the add experience reference we defined in our global script. We're also going to add our reference to our update script, and this is it. In our update exp node, we change the text of the leveling label, we change the text of our experience label, we do a calculation to divide the current global experience by the current bracket to get our percentage, and we use that percentage to scale our experience sprite. Next we're just going to save the project and make the world scene our main scene so we can run it. From here you'll see that when we click on the green node we'll add experience points to our bar and once we get to 90 we level up. If we click on the blue button we'll add a lot of experience and because it's more than 2 and 3 combined we skip to level 4. If we click on it again we'll go to level 5, add a few more and if we click on it again we will reach level cap and the experience will equal 0 since we can't level up anymore. 